What is up guys, Madden Mobile Elite here with my first YouTube video, um, and today I will just be going over my team, who I use, how I use them, and some of their basic stats. Pretty basic video for my first post, and um, hopefully with all your help we can help this channel get bigger and point it in a, in a direction that all you guys want it to go. So if you, if, there's, if you know anyone out there that loves Madden Mobile as much as I do and as much as you do, Please point this channel out as we can make this successful. So, moving right into my team. Here we go. I am an 89 overall with a 90 overall offense, 87 defense, and 90 special teams. And my Troy Aikman is my quarterback, 94 overall MVP. I really love this card. It works out great for me. His speed is actually better than most quarterbacks. Um, and his accuracy, short, is great. Within 15 yards, he'll throw perfect catch every time if you have a decent uh, receiver with no coverage um, and his accuracy mid and deep isn't bad and his awareness is great so if someone's on him he'll move right out of the pocket and get away so next my running game and you also you want to have a fast running game um, if you don't you'll find it harder to run the ball and you also want to have a good balance between speed and trucking because trucking he'll be able to, he'll be able to blast through players but generally, when you have a good speed, your trucking tends to go down, or vice versa. But in this case, DeMarco Murray's is a perfect balance, so that's why I love that card. And my receiving cards, I have a Keenan Allen 93, Brandon Marshall 93, Vincent Jackson 91, and Julius Thomas 92. Now, while all of their speeds are below 93, their catches are all above 95. So what, how I generally tend to play with them is I'll play for the first down, and I won't get very many yards after. But that's okay with me. As long as I get the first down and keep driving down the field, it works out. Offensive line, it isn't bad. It isn't good. I mean, high 86s, high 80s, 183, my elite Josh Sitton, not bad. It protects my quarterback decently well. Moving on to my defense, it it's not bad. It's not as good as my offense is, but still not bad. Got a couple elites on here. And I used to, my linebackers are really nice. I used to have more better linebackers. I used to have a 96 Linden Vay. I, I loved it, but I had to sell him. I wanted to complete the Grunk set, and that's what I did. And I sold the Grunk to start making some of my coins. Vontae Davis, 96 cornerback. He works out great. Um, Vaughn Miller, 91. Julius Peppers. Julius Peppers and Vontae Davis normally get the most interceptions on my team. Let me see. Julius Peppers' catch is... I'm sorry, catch isn't one of the categories, but his hit power, 95. He's great for a linebacker, either in the backfield or trying to get the quarterback. And next, we have my special teams, which is a so-so special teams. Percy Harvin, not a bad kick returner. I mean, I kind of wanted him to have a better speed, but how can I turn down a 96 kick returner? 93 speed isn't bad, and his kick return stat is 97, so where can I go wrong? And then everything else is so-so. So that is my team. Um, love it or hate it, that's it. And it works out great for me. So to finish off this video, what I'm going to do for you guys is I'm going to do three pro packs and a large quick sell. So let's see if we can pull anything good from either of those. If we do, that'd be great. Good luck in this first video here. Let's go... Where's it at? Upgrades. Large quick sell. Got just enough trophies for you guys right before this video. What I do to get gold trophies is I either sell my gold players that I get from Pro Packs or I snipe them for under 2k. It's really easy and you get make a, you can either sell them for 4k or you can use them in these packs and try to make a profit. More often than not though you'll get 10k or under in these large quick sell packs but that's okay. So let's jump right into the pack. See what we get. And reveal, as we get 25,000, not bad, could be better, but not bad. I believe, yeah, definitely made a profit, so that's not bad. Alright, so moving on to these pro packs here. Knock out a couple pro packs, and that should wrap up this video. Let's see what we get here. I'm looking forward to when new packs come out. Hopefully it's going to be either be Road to the Playoffs, it's probably going to be Premium Packs are going to be the next ones to come out. Legends just came out before the players bundle and i believe road to the playoff came out before that so hopefully we'll be seeing premium packs here soon 
I'll be hitting those up for you guys. Alright, so let's see what we get here. A couple silver, some bronze, and where's our gold player? 85 cornerback Greg Toller. Week 19, that's one of the new week, uh, the new, um, the new cards. That's pretty good. He'll probably sell for around 15k. That's good, that's good. Making our money back. Um, making our money back. So let's see what we get here in our second pack. 83 road to the playoffs. EJ Gaines, I believe, is his is how you say his name. Not bad as well. I could probably sell him for a profit. Hopefully he goes in the MVP set. Might not, but if he does, he'll be worth even more. Last pack. As we get a... Oops. All right, here we go. Last two cards of the pack opening. As we get an 89 Devontae Adams. Week 19, guys, this is great. Great pack opening, guys. Three packs and we get a great card. Not bad, guys. This is a nice lucky first video here. Let's search how good he is real quick. How much he goes for, I mean. Devontae Adams. Week 19. Let me just 89 overall. And there we go. Just made about, looks like, 50k. Yeah, 50k seems to be about the average. 38,000 just sold. Yeah, I'll put him up for 40,000 start price and 50,000. Sell now. Buy now. So, great profit, guys. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. So, guys, that'll just wrap up this video for today. I'm going to try to be posting more tips, tricks, and everything Madden Mobile. So, stay tuned. I'll also be doing more pack openings and helping you out with everything you need to know. So, thank you. And please, just as always, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you all in the next video.